Hello, I am Vladimir Yakovlev, a professional athlete and coach of the Magic Wind International Windsurfing School. In this video tutorial, I will tell you how to properly get into the foot straps and control the planing board. Riding in foot straps is much easier and more comfortable, but getting into them at speed is sometimes not an easy task. In order to easily enter the foot straps, you must learn how to work with the sail correctly and feel the gusts of wind then bad weather will not prevent you from getting into the foot straps. You can find out more about this in the previous video if you follow this link. I also advise you to watch a video on setting up your equipment which describes how to properly adjust the size of the foot straps. If you have never tried to get into the foot straps, then I recommend putting them on the board into the training position. This will help a lot. So, you want to get into the foot straps as soon as the board has started planing but has not yet gained too much speed and started getting tossed around on the chop or wave. The foot strapping sequence is as follows. First, the front foot is inserted, then within 1 to 4 seconds goes the back foot. The reverse sequence is incorrect. Before you lift your front foot from the board, you should hang low on the sail, then load the boom with your hands, resting your weight on the power joint, thereby unloading the front foot, and transfer it into the foot strap. Your weight is distributed between the back foot and the mast foot. Be careful, if you overload the mast foot, you can get catapulted. And if you overpress the back foot, the board will turn into the wind. While inserting the front foot into the strap, try to apply pressure on the toes so that the heel does not overpress the rail. Remain hanging low. Now, before placing your back foot into the strap, you need to unload it, otherwise you will definitely overpress the stern. Your task is to correct the balance between the power joint and the front foot so as to unload the back foot as much as possible. As soon as the back foot is unloaded, you can put it into the strap. It is very important that when the back foot gets into the strap, you do not transfer your body weight back. The exit from the foot straps occurs in reverse order. Lower the body, loading the mast foot, first take out the back foot, then the front one. Then you can straighten up. You need to hang as far as possible to the side of the board. When you lower your body, make sure not to end up above the board again, because in this case you will lose the counterweight, spontaneously open the sail, lose acceleration and overpress the stern with your feet. The higher your riding level, the better you hang on the sail and thereby load the power joint more correctly. In this position, there is no need to squat hard and put pressure on the boom with your hands, all this happens by itself. While strapped in, try to completely sheet in. At the same time, your body should hang low and perpendicular to the center line of your board. In this position, the front leg is straight, the back is slightly bent. Depending on the course you select, the back leg may bend more or be more straightened. Now let's talk about the control of the board when planing. Steering the planing board is accomplished by pressing with your heels or toes. If it is difficult for you to put pressure on your toes, bend your knees a little and everything will work fine. As you increase the speed, you should adjust the pressure between the power joint and your feet. If there is not enough speed or wind, distribute the weight more to the mast foot and your front foot. If your speed is average, then the weight distribution will be equal between the power joint and both feet. If there is a lot of wind, you should not take the load off the mast foot and continue to put pressure on it, but now the back foot gets more weight. All this is done while maintaining a low body position and weight transfer is carried out by bending and straightening the back foot.
you can get even more valuable advice if you join our traveling windsurfing school Magic Wind. Enjoy your ride. Bye. Like and follow the channel and subscribe to our mailing list on the website for more information.